Hello guys, Waspinator here. <coughs> oh, sorry, he was controlling me. Um, what's up, guys? Um, got my review here for Animated Waspinator. You can see he's a wasp. See, just like the Beast Wars character, Waspinator. As you can see, he's still a Decepticon. I would imagine he not being on a bot, I don't know. Okay, um, nerd. So, uh, here he is. Um, here's his box. As you can see, it always looked different from, uh, the actual figure. Um, let me give you a little background on this guy. His uh specs. Whatever. Um Alright, so uh his uh motto is uh Waspinator rules. Of course, um and it says he is a mutant madman. Okay, here it is. Driven crazy by locked in an Autobot prison, Waspinator is determined to take revenge on the robot who put him there, Bumblebee. Now after bizarre experiments conducted by his other his other beast war homage, Black Arachnia, he finally has the power to make his vengeance a reality. He has come to Earth hunting the Autobot Speedster. And he will not uh, stop until Bumblebee is a pile of smoking scrap. His galactic powers and abilities. Energy Stinger paralyzes other robots. Can survive even after being blown to pieces. That's kind of an homage to where he usually up blown to pieces in uh, the uh, Beast Wars. And was an Autobot before his prison time. That hardly seems like a galactic power or ability. Um, that second one can survive even after being blown to pieces is pretty funny. Like I said, because it's like a Beast Wars homage. Um, for gimmick, all it is is uh this. Don't blink. That's it. Yep. That's about it. So, um, you can see he's very nice. His colors in this mode is green, black, and uh, purple. Translucent purple. That's about it for that. The colors. Let's compare him to. Black Arachnia. As you can see, they're pretty sized up well. Black Arachnia is a little bit longer. No, actually, Waspinator is counting his tail. Okay. Put her aside. Now let's get on to the transformation. So first, what you want to do is pull down the legs. Sorry, my leg likes to pop off all the time. And then flip down the feet. It's gonna happen throughout the video. Sorry, guys. Flip that feet down. Little feetums. Quoting JT Mitchell there. Sorry. Flip the arms out like that. Flip those little feelers down. And flip the wasp head down, and out comes his wasp near head. It's like swoop, where his head became part of the robot head. Those little feelers up here. That's kind of cool. I like that. They're rubber though. So then, what you want to do for the arm? is close it down and there's gonna be a peg right in there and it'll all go into place. Ah, 
lost my lost my leg. Lost my leg. Okay, so I'm gonna do the same with the other thing. Other arm. Sorry. And uh, you can keep his wings wherever you want them. Flip them up, flip them down. And then this mode, same gimmick. Only looks a little weird. So, as you can see, he's got a nice head sculpt. Very bumblebee shaped, kinda. If you think about it. If you kind of put these down, it looks like his old head. Before he turned into a mutant madman. See? So maybe that's where they got his antennas from. It's still kind of cool. Alright, um. His colors are the same. Green, purple, and light green. Um, he does not rotate at the hand. Because, you know, the way it transformed. Um, but he does rotate at the shoulder, which is nice, and I just popped his arm off. Mine's a very loose figure, sorry. But, still, I like him. Let's size him up to his rival here, Bumblebee. Sorry, this is my custom Bumblebee. Uh, didn't feel like transforming my other Bumblebee. As you can see, Bumblebee is taller than him. Which they were supposed to be same, that, you know, like size the same, but that's alright. I mean, they're okay. Uh, sorry, guys. My tripod is kind of suckish. That's alright. So, um, there's a video review for Animated Waspinator. Let me do a little box art real quick. There he is, kind of crazy looking. He's ready to attack Bumblebee. Inside there. Almost like a duck. And there's a whole box room. And, uh, also available. I have all three of these. Want me to review them? Let me know. And there is the video review for Mr. Wasp, aka Waspinator. Bye, guys. Wasp me out. That was a weird game. Sorry.